When we talk about fast broadband nowadays, people imagine fiber cables running throughout the home, giving us speeds from 100 megabits per second to 1 gigabit per second. But what if we told you we found another way to get 500 megabits per second super fast internet to your home without any wires? What up guys, Miguel here of Gigatech, and in this video, we are going to share with you what we have discovered after using DTOS latest Unli 5G home Wi-Fi for several weeks now. All right, let's start off by showing you a live speed test we're getting here at the Yugatech studio before we go any further about this new device we're using. So I'll be using open signal to run our speed test and let's go. Okay, so we're getting a latency of 23 milliseconds or a ping and our download is at 365 megabits per second and our upload is at 24.9 megabits per second. So far, so good, right? And you would think you can only get this kind of speed if you subscribe to expensive fiber internet plans that would cost you over two or even 3,000 pesos per month. With this Unli 5G home Wi-Fi solution, you're only spending 1,500 pesos a month for a limited 5G internet at home. Okay, I'm guessing for those of you still watching, we've tickled your interest thus far. So let me show you the device. This small, lightweight device is Dito's latest 5G home Wi-Fi. It comes with a SIM slot down here. And it also works as a Wi-Fi router for your home or office. And if you want to extend the Wi-Fi coverage, you can also plug up to four LAN cables here at the back. The default username and password can be found at the bottom, along with the admin information for the control panel. You can change all of these once you are logged into the Wi-Fi network and that's basically it. From here, we get fast and affordable broadband internet at home and without all that waiting time for a technician to visit you. Install and configure everything just like what you would expect if you're getting fiber cable. It's basically plug and play, like literally. We've been using the Dito 5G home Wi-Fi service for the past few weeks and we're pretty much satisfied with the service coverage and speed. Of course, the performance will also depend on your location and setup at home. And it even, well, this particular like router thing, it even, it's Wi-Fi 6. So at the time of shooting this video, the Dito home 5G postpaid is available in most parts of Cavite, Davao, Laguna, 490 barangays across NCR, and 50 barangays in Cebu, and 11 barangays in Matawe. You can visit the Dito website through the link in the description box below if you want to see the full area coverage list. Earlier, we mentioned that you can get this postpaid plan for less than 1.5 thousand pesos. Well, there are actually two types of monthly plans you can look into. The first plan is a data cap plan with a 200 gigabyte monthly data allocation, which only costs 990 pesos a month. This is great if you are not a heavy user, you seldom connect to the internet at home, or if you're using this as a backup internet solution to an existing wired connection. The best thing about this is that whatever data you did not consume in that month will be rolled over to the next month, but not beyond that. The second one is an unlimited data plan, which is pretty self-explanatory. This plan costs 1,490 pesos a month. And to sweeten that deal, Nito is giving an introductory promo price of 745 pesos per month for the first six months of you signing up, which doesn't sound too bad. Both postpaid plans have a promised speed of up to 500 megabits per second. And from our experience, we're getting really good speeds in the range of 412 megabits per second to 520 megabits per second during off to peak hours. Some of you gamers might be wondering, how's the latency and ping times? Well, we've been playing Mobile Legends using the Wi-Fi connection for days on end and have not experienced any lags at all. Most of the time, it is somewhere between 20 to 60 milliseconds and it isn't that bad for Mobile Legends. I'm sure our loyal viewers who play a lot of Mobile Legends will agree that 50 milliseconds-ish is more than good enough. And for those of you curious if we can bring this router around, well, yes! 
We've been using this in several houses at different locations. We even brought this out to a Starbucks for a group meeting and ML session with our teammates. What's more fun is that we can even use it inside the car while traveling around the city. I mean, all you need is probably like a inverter for your uh, lighter port in your car that turns it into a normal wall port. Or, you know, you can have those fancy EcoFlow power banks that are the um, feature normal sized AC ports or power ports. So yeah, and as you can see in this B-roll, we have our Android head unit here in our vehicle, which runs off of the Dito Wi-Fi hardware. All for subscription plans that cost you as low as 990 pesos to 1,490 pesos a month. This is very practical and affordable. They even include a free 30-day Prime Video subscription. Plus, you also earn Dito Rewards points whenever you pay your bill, which you can redeem for other goodies. If you want to know more about Dito's 5G home Wi-Fi and want to try and subscribe to the affordable plans yourself, you can visit the Dito website, which again is in the description box below. And if you have any questions about this device or our experience, just leave us a comment and we'll try to answer all your questions based on our experience. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video or found it informative, be sure to smack that like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit that bell icon so you get notified of our future uploads. Also, follow us on Facebook, X, Instagram, and TikTok, and be sure to visit yugatech.com for the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this has been Miguel, and I'll see ya in the next one. Would it have been weird if I said, I'll see ya, I'll see ya, Dito? Of course it'd be weird, because you guys wouldn't be here. But yeah, Dito.